Our next inductee into the Ohio Basketball Hall of Fame is Perry Reese Jr. The story of, his, of this high school coach is, is nothing short of amazing. An African-American man of Catholic faith who graduated from Muskingum University began his coaching career in Guernsey Central Catholic in Guernsey County. Perry eventually arrived to the Amish area of Holmes County in Berlin, Ohio, at the behest of Hall of Fame coach Charlie Huggins. It was 1983, and at that time frame and the setting, Reese wasn't well received by some in the predominantly white and rural area. A little history lesson. In 1982, Berlin was the largest Amish settlement in the world. And yes, the town was a little less than thrilled about a black man in their community. But it was also a community whose children grew up reading tales of how the ancestors were burned at the stake by the Catholics during the Reformation in Europe, more than 400 years previous to that. So in baseball, we would call that strike two. But Perry didn't strike out. Perry eventually overcame culture, a culture that didn't immediately embrace him and at the same time proved his worth and his trust that Coach Huggins put in him. Perry became the head coach of Berlin Highland in 1984. The Hawks win a combined of 49-4 and four in his first two seasons with Reese as the, head, as the head coach and advanced to the 1986 state semifinals. Perry went on to win 11 conference titles, five trips to the state tournament, and won the 1992 state title and Division IV championship game. In his 16 seasons as head coach, Reese compiled a record of 304 and 85. In 2014, in an honor of Sports Illustrated's 60th anniversary, SI.com republished in full 60 of its best stories ever to appear in the magazine. Higher Education by Gary Smith was one of the selections. The article stated, in the unlikeliest place, Ohio's Amish country, a high school basketball coach, changed the community's ideas about race and about life. That coach was Perry Reese Jr. Please, enter, please welcome me as we enter Perry Reese Jr. into the Hall of Fame. We introduce him and, and, and induct him posthumously. He passed away in 2000 at the age of 48. Accepting for Perry Reese Jr. tonight is his sister, Audrey Harp Hardy. Thank you. First and foremost, I'd like to give praise and honor to our God, because we would not be here. Also, we would like to honor all those who have accepted any award tonight. And for those who know me, I'm very emotional, and I'm trying my best not to, because I've had people today who just continue to want it to make me cry. <sighs> First, Perry would agree that right now this honor would go to his team, not to him and anyone else, because he felt that his players were very important. Second, I would like to thank everyone for their journeys. I do not call them stories, because here's why. Anyone who met Perry, they would leave. He, Perry could leave either an impression or an impact on a person's life. And also as tonight, as always, I thank everyone for the different journeys that you have shared with me regarding Perry. Thirdly, Perry's family would like to thank the community of Highland. Because without Highland Hawks, the friendships, the journeys, the values, the valleys, the different things that everyone shared with our brother, we would not be here. And I say thank you, Highland. Go Hawks. OK. Also, I'd like to thank Dan and Jay. You may not know it, but right now, they're finishing up the documentary regarding Perry. I did not find this out till today when I came in. So don't be surprised if you happen to be on YouTube or anything else regarding how they're going to show it, because I do not know it. But I do want to say thank you for all that you have done regarding this here. <laughs> 